So I, I want to touch briefly upon this. Um, I don't know if you guys have been looking at the headlines in the newspapers yesterday and today. Uh, Darcy Tucker and Shane Corson have been appointed uh, by the CRA, right? Yeah. Of, uh, of um, become, getting into some sort of tax shelter, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I did. I did. That, that was um, in the view of the CRA nefarious. Now, um, they both got dinged for a huge amount of money. Shane's appealing it. And but Darcy walked away from the appeal, so he's I guess he settled with them. Yeah, but it's 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 bizarre how the press picked up on that. Oh, it doesn't take much, Frank. You know yeah, that. Yeah, and I, mean. I I know Shane very well. He's a friend of mine. Um, if it's true, which I believe it might be, could be, maybe not. According to CRA, it is. Yeah, but but I I know Shane, and somebody sucked him into doing something like that because he is not that type of guy. I wouldn't disagree with that. I, 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 well, you know him, but I, he's, I'm proud to call him my friend. And I'm, I'm, I'm positive, I'm positive that he, if it's true, the, the allegation against him, right, uh, it, he was sucked in by somebody to do that. Yeah, I guess Tucker wired like thirty two grand into an account with a U.K. brokerage then joined Corson in investing uh, in some foreign currency trading, <clears throat> which was uh, obviously not... Uh, legal and, and, they, and they didn't. No, that's not what. Well, that's not my interpretation. My interpretation of what I read is now. exactly like that. So I send you thirty-two grand, right? Oh. You send it back to me, and you show a trade. That, and but I wasn't really part of that trade. I didn't lose in that trade, but I show the loss. So I oh, carry I, that forward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I make oh, yeah. I carry that forward, right? Yeah. As a loss, to not pay taxes. So the thirty-two grand gets taken off of your salary, so you don't pay taxes on that part of your the salary. Loss. Yeah, a loss. <laughs> yeah. So, so the way I interpreted what was described was that the the CRA saw it in a way that it was a scam. Yeah. That they put the money in this account temporarily, and then it went through another account and got back to them, and they lost nothing. So there's, the CRA is saying that the loss is fictitious. Right, and they want that money back with interest. Yeah, because yeah. Corson, I guess, from two thousand to two thousand two, claimed that he lost seven That's and a half million dollars. They, they alleged that he said. Yeah, that. Tucker allegedly lost over a million in that. Uh, uh, yeah, so frame as well. Yeah, okay. So, so whatever the tax savings was, they, 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 so the way I read it is that the the CRA is saying you said that you made an investment and you lost. Mm-hmm. You never, you didn't lose. You got your money back. Right. But you told us that you lost, and we didn't charge you any taxes on your salary. So if, let's say they made seven million. I'd, I'd say that the tax on seven million dollars, uh, jump in if I'm uh, I'm wrong, is about five point nine million. No, that's that's high. That's too high. That's no, high. It's, it's a little over in Canada. You, oh, no, you want the tax wouldn't be almost no, six million. It's up. It's up. Yeah. It's about half. Yeah, so that's that's but three point seven five. Sixty two, but yeah. Frank, it's also forty two. I, 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 I don't make that much I don't make that amount of money, so I wouldn't be able to tell you, but it gets to the point where you become partners with the government. Right. Very much so. But if this so, is so, true, then definitely the government there's has, a lot of back tax. Has, the government has conceded to legal legal tax, right? Mm-hmm. Right offs. The, like one of the biggest legal tax that the government allows you to give money to charities. Yep, that's right. Yeah, I mean that's the way to get your. If you're making a lot, obviously you can. You know, charities, obviously, uh, you know, TFSAs, RRSPs, things like that to get your income down, right? But um, it, it seems like what they were doing, obviously, was was very different. Yeah, I, I I feel badly for both of them, and I'm with Frank in the sense that uh, there's a pretty good salesman around town that had come up with a scheme that was right. going to get them their income tax free. Doesn't I, I, I know I know Shane. I agree with exactly what you said. Is you 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 re, you understood exactly what I was saying? I'm I'm telling you that I know Shane. There's not a malicious bone in him. He's the most kind-hearted human being I've ever met in my life. And I've seen Shane lose a lot of money, lots of money in investments because he trusts people. Mm-hmm. 
That's the story of a lot of athletes. It's happened yeah. to so many of them. It's, it's, yeah. it's terrible. Shane's a good human being. He's yeah. got a heart of gold. Wrong person. And, and, but so we'll see how that works out. I found that it's extremely he's just, sad when I read that. Uh, maybe he'll, he'll get a deal where he can pay it off. I don't know. The key is when you get a tax deal like that, you put the money away that they give you so that you have it when they charge you. Yeah. You know, like tax shelters, if you, get, if you shelter a million bucks and you get 700000 back that you normally would pay in tax, the smart man, the shrewd man, puts the 700000 in short-term notes. Yeah, uh, I, mean, I, 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 I talked to a great it. man once, Don, and this tip. is what he said to me. If you're paying 60% tax, get on your knees and thank God that you're making lots of money. Yeah, that's right. And don't try and up it. It's inconsequential when you're making that money. I, I really don't give a fuck because at least I know my money is going to uh, making uh, the, the live, standard of living in Canada extremely well. Here, see, people don't understand this, and I'm like, I'm not a, trying to parade for the CRA. I'm just saying, here, here's the, the when you fuck the government for money, right? You're fucking the school buses, you're fucking the roads, you're fucking the medicine. Uh, 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 Kids' hospitals, you're fucking everybody. But meanwhile, Frank, there is a thought that in Ottawa there are 365 of the same types of crooks. They don't trust them. They don't trust them. Our system of government in our country uh, for the last, uh, we were 100 years old in 1967. So, so what are we, 143, 142 years old now? Well, 36, 67, and 33 is 100, and you add on 20, uh, or pardon me, is 33, you add on 20, 53. 53 years. Yeah, 153 years, right? Yeah. We, we fought to be where we are right now, and our little country, uh, actually the largest country in the world by land, our little country has uh, maintained one of the highest standard of living in the world. Yep. But, you know, our tax... Our tax is very high here. Absolutely. Absolutely. So if you if we were to get you know when we get our, our uh, pay stub, if you were to if it were to be detailed right where all your money goes, it, well I think there is some details right. Yeah, when you look at your pay stub, it tells you what goes to EI, what goes to each. No, but it doesn't tell you like in the states, like uh, 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 what is it, forty five or fifty percent of somebody's taxes goes to the military. I didn't know that. That high? Yeah, I think I think almost fifty percent, um, almost fifty cents of every tax dollar that's collected from people, income tax, goes to the military.